Hey! Patricia! How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Um, you you're done, right? Yeah, I'm done. I, I was wondering mm. if you'd um, like to come over to the bar later today and have a drink or two on the house. I will take a rain check on that. I have a job interview tomorrow morning, so I have to go get ready. But anyways, thanks for the offer, though. Yo, maybe some other time. Yeah. <laughs> and then good luck on your job interview. Thank you very much. All right, guys. Take care. All right, Cordelia. Take care. Jude, Patricia, not Cordelia. Sorry, 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 sorry. Please, forgive me. Patricia, take care. <laughs> Why would you call Patricia Cordelia? Why would you attack me for making a simple mistake? I don't understand. What well, you don't make mistakes? It was an honest mistake, guy. Really? Uh, yeah. Let's go and change and go to your bar. Ask me a question. Where go now? You want go pool? This guy is safe. Ah. You should take it easy, yo. You're driving, remember? Look, allow me, alright? Allow me to drink, okay? I, I have to drink right now to be a responsible husband. Just allow me to drink, please. It's official. Please. You're drunk. I'm not okay. drunk. I'm not there yet. No, I'm not drunk, but seriously, I need to drink, alright? I have to drink to be able to perform my conjugal duties when I get home. Let me drink. Wait, you. You don't need alcohol to get Junior up? Oh, well, 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 yeah. Since when? Oh, since my wife stopped being attractive. You didn't see Cordelia, she's no longer that beautiful woman that I fell in love with and married. Come on, you're just, you're just exaggerating. No, don't get me that bad. But you think I'm, I'm, I'm making this up? All right, I'll show you. I'll show you what I'm dealing with. She may no longer be. No. That's Whoa! Her. Look at her. No, 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 you're kidding. This, this cannot be Cordelia. That is my wife! It's, it looks alike. That, it's my wife. That, 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 that's my wife. How? No, I, look at me now. Look, look at me. What have I done wrong? Look, I am a certified, certified fitness trainer. I run one of the biggest gym centers in town, and then that's my wife. She looks like a duplex. How ironic. Really? You tell me not to drink? I have to drink. So, so what, what do you plan to do about it? I don't know. She won't come to the gym. She won't watch what she eats. She's My wife here. is always nibbling on something. No, sir, she's still your wife. You Never mind. Why is she calling me? Hello? Hello? Where are you? Hmm? Uh, I'm at Ike's place. Look, it's getting too late. When are you coming home? Yeah, pretty soon. <sighs> I need a drink, man. I can need a drink. All right, I, I See, need a drink. Drinking will not solve it. It wouldn't solve it. You know, if you won't give me a drink, I can get a drink somewhere else, right? You know, you know that, right?
Look at who you. is Patricia? You. <laughs> No, sir. Mm. No, sir. Mm. Are you drunk? No, sir. Who is Patricia? I'm talking to you. Patricia. Patricia. What? But My husband was at your bar late last night, Patricia. drinking. And then when he got home, he called me Patricia. Uh, oh, why would Nosa do a thing like that? I, Ike, don't let thunder fire you now, no. And that's because I know you know about this. So tell me, who is Patricia? Cordelia, like you said, Nosa, your husband was here drinking last night, so he left here drunk. I'm sure he didn't know what he was saying. You shouldn't take anything seriously. <laughs> Ike, if I eventually find out who Patricia is, I will kill you before I deal with Nusa. Me? What's my own here now? That's because you're his closest friend. And friends like you know exactly when husbands start cheating on their wives and then you do everything to cover him up. Look, if Nusa, your husband, is cheating, which I strongly doubt, he should be the one you kill, not me. I have nothing to do with it now. I will not kill him. And that's because I do not want to be a widow. Uh. Yes, but I will kill you and skin you alive. That's because you are his accomplice. Try me. Can you match me? Rubbish. Yeah, hold on. Hey. Ah, guy, you won't break my door. Because I have now. What did you drink apart from liquor that made you call your wife Patricia? Oh boy, I forget that thing was an honest mistake, honestly. Really? Yes. No. Is that what you keep telling yourself? I want to worry you now. I mean, look, this thing can happen to anybody. Patricia, Cordelia, they all sound alike. I beg. I free me, I beg. Good job. What was that for? To change your brain to a different setting. Yes, your wife has threatened to kill me. She thinks if you're cheating, I have to know about it. Oh, well, she's not going to kill you because I'm not cheating. Eh. Yes. Why then would you call Patricia Cordelia and Cordelia Patricia? Eh, because it sounds alike. Cordelia, Patricia, Patricia, Cordelia. Sha, sha. It, what? It, it does not sound alike. You can't make that kind of mistake. Really? <coughs> you make that mistake all the time. Uh -uh. What's in this guy? Don't give you a drink. I have answered you now like 500 times. It was a simple mistake. Cordelia, Patricia, Cordelia, Patricia, Cordelia. This same mistake you have made it like 500 times. What did you do? You guys said that, Greg. You, you won't put yourself for trouble, though. Now you go and touch I'm not waiting this Patricia guy give you, make you drink, though. Don't they make mistake where you come from? Which one? Ah. Half an hour. You watch that match? Which match? You enjoy match, now. Eh. Uh, no, now they watch well, they watch well. I got that kind of time. Eh. Uh, mm. When I get him, we get to the Beatles. Hello, Dr. Benjamin. Uh, good afternoon, it's me. Yes, um, I would like to book an appointment to come and see you at the clinic later. Yes, um, I've been feeling very funny lately, you know. I, I get very tired easily, even when I don't do strenuous activity. Plus, I, I always have this constant headache, you know, yes, that affects my breath sometimes. Oh, okay, Doc. Yeah, I will see you soon. All right, thank you.
Hallo, uh, Tunde. It's me, no, sir. Oh, sorry, my bad. It was my mistake. Um, hi, no, sir. No, that wasn't even funny at all, okay? Oh, now you know my name. <laughs> I thought I was Patricia. But I just explained to you, darling, it was a mistake. It was an honest mistake. You must think I am dumb, no, sir. Cordelia, I'm not cheating on you. Oh, no, no, no. Go ahead. Keep denying it, because the truth is, I'm not even sure I'm ready for you to admit it yet, okay? Because there is nothing to admit. I have to go now, please. I'm about to drive. Besides, I just stepped out of the clinic. Oh, clinic? Are, are you okay? As if you care. You're doing well. You're doing well. Again? You have two more to go now. Come on now. You can do this. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> That's it. Okay. One last one. One last one. One last oh, one. Good. You can do this. Come on. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. Okay? You're doing okay. All right, just catch your breath. You're doing fine. Okay? Catch your breath. All right. <laughs> Babe, <laughs> you're here. Yeah. I didn't know you were standing here. Yeah, um, I wasn't feeling too fine today, so I had to drop by the clinic. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you, you said that over the phone. Uh, and um, the doctor said I, that my BP is shooting high, and so I need to lose some weight if I don't want any unwanted health challenges. <sighs> Babe. You see what I've been saying to you, right? It so, is time you begin to live a healthy life. Yeah. So, okay. I want to start exercising like right now. Are you serious? Yeah. Uh, you want to start right now? Right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, boy. You, you know what? Let me just, uh, let me finish up with the clients I have over there. Okay. And I'll set you up. Yeah, that's fine. All right? Yeah, fine. Great. Um, Auntie. Okay. Let's go. <clears throat> Auntie. Hi. Hello. I hope you know this is a gym and not a strip club like you're dressed. This is my workout outfit. Oh, really? Yeah. So how about you start working out in your bathe suit since you have no shame? I beg your pardon. Your gym instructor is a married man and I am his wife. So tell me, what exactly is your plan? Coming out here looking so unclad all in the name of workout? And now is it your own business what I choose to wear for my workout? Really? Yeah. And so that makes you comfortable with another woman's husband holding your waist. You don't have the fear of God. I paid good money to work out here. And I take exceptions for unwarranted harassment such as this. <laughs> good money, right? Yeah. Your membership is hereby terminated. You hear me? I will make sure that they refund you every penny you paid by this time tomorrow. So that you can go and practice your act of seduction somewhere else. Now, shh, go. I don't have time for this rubbish. Get out. No. Get out! Don't ever come.
kneel down <laughs> and sit on you if you do not watch your mouth right now. I would like to see you try. Uh-huh. Uh Fine. Get out of this gym or I'll Who throw the you heck out. Are you? I said get out or I'll Who throw are you, you out to now. do that? You have no right to do that. <laughs> Cheating on me with a client at your gym, right? Cordelia, what are you on about? I'm not cheating on you. Okay, you know what? Now that we're talking about it, why would you even pick a fight with a client at my place of business? She called me fat. And did you call her a show off? Yeah, I'm asking you, did you say that she was intimidating you with her workout program? Did you say okay, that to okay, her? Okay, let me understand. Are you, are you, are you supporting her right now? That's besides the point. I'm trying to make... You know, Cordelia coming to the gym, mm. I just realized. Like, <sighs> it's a terrible idea. I'm telling you, I, I didn't think it through. It is How a bad so? idea. Do you know that Cordelia came to the gym mm. yesterday? Now, instead of working out, she picked a fight with Patricia. Ah. Now, not just that, she sent another client packing, claiming that this client came to my gym indecently dressed. <laughs> oh, boy. See what I'm dealing with now. Where are you with all this drama that happened? Laugh, oh. Eh? Laugh, oh. Wait, wait, wait. Come on. Is she now telling me that she expects the ladies to. Tie double wrappers and tie gilly. Ask me now. <laughs> Don't be gym house. Uh, uh. So right now, the challenge is, I, I'm thinking of, you know, how to convince her to stop coming to the gym. Wait. The challenge before she started coming was how to get her to start coming to the gym. Well. And now, the challenge is how to get her to stop coming. Oh, she has to stop. No, she has to stop. Else that girl go shut down that place from you. I know. No, she's going to shut it down. <laughs> She go push my customers. That, what, what, what have I done? Man, I do not envy you right now. No, you shouldn't see what I'm dealing with. Uh -uh. From where to where now? It's in drama. I don't understand. You, 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 you come, you don't, you, you want to work out, then, then you pick fights and get unnecessarily insecure. What's your with me? Perhaps she needs to open up a gym for her at home. Maybe <laughs> give her dog. No, I could just leave her as she fat. We should just be in the house. Uh -uh, I would talk like that. No, but what, 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 what now? Help your baby. No, you know what I went through to set that place up? I know. She's going to run me out of business. You see why men die young, Abby? I <laughs> know. <laughs> Something to drink? No, if I eat, no, no, no. In fact, double portion. <laughs> now die like this, you. You're not going to die, Jay. 
Kom ind. Good morning, mom. Morning. <clears throat> Have we met? No, I've not seen you before. It's okay. Sit. Thank you. Mm. Miss Patricia Daniel, that's your name, right? Yes, ma. Um, well, judging from the report I got from our HR, you are the most qualified candidate shortlisted for that job. Thank you, Ma. You have the educational qualification and experience required for that position. But you lack one vital quality, and that's honesty. Ma, I'm sorry. Uh, how do you mean? I will ask you again, Miss Patricia. Have we met before? Please, I beg you in the name of God, forgive me. I, I didn't mean to disrespect you. It, it was the work of the devil. See, my mother trained me well. Uh, and, and I really need this job. May your finish line never be moved. May God protect and guide you. Just Amen. Me. Amen. 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 So how long have you been having an affair with my husband? Hmm? I know that you have been seeing my husband. Now, what I want to know is for how long? Madam, I have no idea of what you're talking about. Your husband and I are just client and gym instructor. That's all he is to me, nothing. Yeah, right. You can leave now. Why would you think I'm having an affair get with your husband? Get out of my office or I'll get the security to throw you out. Get out. Okay. It's okay. Um, Ma. Sorry. Um, what about your job? <laughs> Don't worry, darling. We will call you. Get out. Get out. We will call you. Oh, please. <laughs> is it like to be fair? And here she is on my table looking for a job. <laughs> Uh, more girls. Oh dear lad. I'm qualified for this job. She even said it herself. Like I really need this job. I need it more than anything in this whole world right now. You know, let's just um wait for Nosa to get here. I I'm sure he would figure out something. Please call him again. The last time I called him, he said he was on his way here. Call him again? Uh. Just call him. Oh. Why don't your wife think that we are having, that I'm having an affair with you? Hey, 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 slow down. So, what did you say? Where did she get that from? Okay. I was called for a final confirmation on the job I got in that insurance firm. Okay. Guess who was supposed to confirm me? Your wife. Oh, wow. Oh, the world is indeed a small place. Indeed. And she accused me of having an affair with you. Why would she think that? I want to know. Screaming. I have no idea. Um, are you sure it has nothing to do with the fact that... Um, you called your wife Patricia instead of Cordelia 
the night you were drunk. Oh, what? No, you just heard him. I was drunk. Okay, I was, I was drunk. That is not an excuse. Now I know why she's so mad at me. Uh, uh, listen, we, 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 we all need to calm down. Um, no, sir, what do you think we can do to fix this? Fix what? You have to call your wife, sit her down, tell her that I have nothing to do with you. Oh. That you are just my gym instructor. I'm just your client. Uh, what, are you think I haven't tried? You have to try again. Try harder. You have to convince her to give me this job. But I'm sorry, I can't do that. No, I can't interfere. No, I, I can't did do you, that. Did, did you hear your No, point? I will not do it. I, all right? If uh, I do it, oh, you know my wife, you know Cornelia. If I do that, Cornelia will think that this girl is my mistress for real. You know how it looks now? I can't. No, sir, this, this is unfair. This is so, so unfair. This is not nice. Do you know how difficult it is to get a job in this present economy? And now to think of it, to lose a job on just an imaginary affair? Oh, well, I am sorry. Okay? By the way, it's, it's a bar. You're, you're screaming. You're sorry. I, I need something strong. Just get me something to drink. Calm, calm down, right? Get me something to drink! Hey, babe. <laughs> so did your babe. mistress tell you that she was at my office today. <laughs> Job hunting. <laughs> For the opt-in the time, Cordelia. Mm. That girl is not my mistress. I don't believe you. Look. Look, Cordelia. I'm not even going to deny that Patricia is everything that I wish. My wife to look like fitness wise. But you've got to believe me. That's all there is to it. Well, I also wish that my husband becomes a multi billionaire someday. But you don't hear me calling you Otedola by mistake. This is ridiculous. This is very ridiculous. How can I possibly be having an affair with my friend's girlfriend? How, Cordelia? Your friend's girlfriend? Yeah, that girl is, is Ike's girlfriend. Ike? Yes, Ike, 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 yes, my Ike. The same Ike that you know, Ike. Oh, really? Yes, really. That's what I've been trying to say all this time. But no! You will kill me. Really? Hey, Patricia. Um, guess what? I'm not in the mood of guessing. All right. I have been able to convince my wife that you and I are not having an affair. Really? Does that mean I have the job? Mm-hmm. But you are Ike's girlfriend. I'm Ike's girlfriend. Because I told her that you're Ike's girlfriend. Why would you do that? That's the only explanation that could pop in my head at the time, all right? Don't judge me now. Do you want the job or not? Of course I need the job. All right, good. Then calm down. Just play along, all right? You being ex girlfriend, I assure you, is the only way my wife is going to be comfortable. Having you around her. Why? Yeah, I should. Hey, 
Hey, I am so sorry to have left you alone. I, I had to attend to business. Okay. Uh, I just got off the phone with um, Nusa. He was able to convince Cordelia that we are not having an affair. So she will have to give me the job. Th that's good news. You don't seem very excited about it, though. He had to lie that you're my boyfriend so she can trust me to work with me. So right now we have to put up with that lie. That's brilliant. How, how come I never thought of it? What's with the smile? This is going to be fun. Trust me. I, I need a drink. Going to be asking the two of you some questions, and I expect the both of you to answer me together at the same time. Shoot. Okay. Where did you meet Jim? Jim. For how long have you been dating? Four, Four months. months. <laughs> Impressive. But there is something still very fishy. Patricia and I are, are, are so much in love. Mm. Yeah. She's, she's my girlfriend, the love of my, my life. Um, we, we can prove it to you with probably a kiss if you are um, still doubting. No, we don't have to do this. Um, this is a workplace. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. That's fine. Go ahead. Huh? Go ahead and kiss each other. I mean, the crazy in love kind of French kiss. Wow. <laughs> okay. We, we do this all the time. So. I know, right? <laughs> <clears throat> well, oh, that was cute. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, um, I believe you now, Patricia. <laughs> Congratulations, you have the job. Oh, thank yeah. you. Thank you and very much. And you can start on Monday. Wow, I'm grateful. Thank you. Thank well, you're welcome. <laughs> hey, <laughs> we did it. Why did you suggest we kiss in there? I was only trying to be convincing. Really? Yes. She was convinced after we answered all the questions she asked. Thank goodness we rehearsed before going in there. Well, she wasn't acting like she was convinced. I, I just needed to, you know, put some more action. After all, they say action speaks louder than words. You seem to have taken advantage of the situation. Why would you say a thing like that? Okay, how about we go back in there and tell her the whole truth? Since you think I'm taking advantage of you. You can't be serious. No, 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 but, but this, is, this, this is really not nice. I sacrificed my entire day, sacrificed everything to be in there with you. And now we come out here and you're saying this. Do you know how many women that are begging me, doing prayer and fasting to just kiss this my lips? Just one. Really? Yes! Stop being ungrateful. Okay, kiss me again. I will slap you. <laughs> Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Your seat belt. What's with the stair? I am. Um, I've just been wondering. When I would um, move from a um, makeshift boyfriend to the real deal. <laughs> Are you indirectly asking me to be your girlfriend? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry if I sounded 
indirect but my intention was to sound as direct as possible really i know you see a lot of pretty beautiful sexy girls every day at this your bar even at the gym true so why me uh, patricia you're you are a total package. Mm -hmm. You are not just pretty and fit. You you are quite ambitious. And I love that. It's not every girl that would want to be independent and um, fend for herself. Most, most girls I know would uh, cash in on their beauty and depend on any guy f to pay their bills. But that's not the case with you. And that has got me. Really? Thank you very much for the nice words and compliment. But for now, you will still remain my makeshift boyfriend. I like that. I like the sound of that. You said for now. It means there's, there's hope for me. Maybe. Maybe not. Mm-hmm. I don't understand how people just make it all without using the side mirror. You know, it's almost becoming our pattern. Oh, of dude. <laughs> easy now, oh, easy, easy, yeah. easy, easy. Ow! Okay. <laughs> easy, mm. easy. Yeah. Uh, they were, you were great today, I mm. tell you. The workout session was... You're doing good, I'm impressed. I'm I actually impressed. feel very good about myself already. Ah, but my legs and my tummy... I know, I know. It's like hell. It's okay. I'll, I'll help you massage you later. It's, it's fine. Okay. Uh, it's fine. So when am I going to physically start losing weight? Easy now. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I tell you this. With um, the regular workout um, sessions and the healthy diet plan, which is important, I assure you that in a few weeks you will begin. I to can't. See I can't wait. I can't <laughs> wait, I tell you. Right, I know that feeling. Yeah. I know that feeling. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, <clears throat> I think you and I are sticky, all right? Mm-hmm. So probably just get in the shower and then, you know, freshen up. Why together? Yeah, together. You're right. <laughs> what? Wow. Look, 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 look. So let, let me tell you something. My arms ache as well. Yeah, my arms ache. I mean, from all the push-ups and stuff. So mm -hmm. okay. Ow! Okay, okay, <laughs> okay. I'm tired as well. Yeah, but I need you to help me scr scrub my back. So. <laughs> I'm uh, tired as well. Uh-huh. Well, I would have asked you to carry me. Yeah. But I know that your arms ache and you're tired as well. Well, given the fact that we'll be going straight into the shower, you know, I don't think <laughs> I'm necessarily too tired to... To carry you, baby. Maybe we should do some exercise get with it. Get it. Okay. Get it. Ah, okay, now. Nah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, Are you gonna carry me right we'll, now? We'll go try this. Like I should uh, flip. Okay. We can try. Okay, let's go that we way. Can try. We can you try. Know, you know I hate you can, this. You know yeah. what way you do get this. Get on it. Get on it. Okay. Get on it. Get on it. Okay, get on it. Ah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'll shoot it for ah. I will fall. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> That was exhausting. You can do more. No, 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 I can't even do one more. Ah. So nothing can change your mind. I cannot lift a finger right now. Give me 20 and stop being a makeshift boyfriend to so original boyfriend. No, no, okay, come on. I'm sure that I'll fucking wait till tomorrow. No. I'll give you a straight hundred tomorrow. No. 20 now, 
take it or you leave it. And you're not joking, right? I'm not joking. I'm very serious. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Don't give up if you love me. Put in more effort. Eighteen, nineteen, twenty. <laughs> Who is your boyfriend now? You are, baby. Who is your boyfriend You now? are, baby. Where were you? Maybe I was in the restroom. I'm sure you went to look for me in the kitchen, right? Well, I was just wondering where you were. But um, I tell you this. I'm very happy that I didn't find you there. Honey, I am way over that lifestyle. You see that unhealthy lifestyle? It's not for me anymore. I'm so proud of you. You're doing so well, I tell you. Just keep it up, you'll be fine. I want to do this. I want to. I believe you can. I will. All right? I believe more than you believe that you can. It is so beautiful. Mm, like when I lose some more weight. Mm -hmm. You mm -hmm. even look mm. more beautiful. Me what? Me what? How are you so slim, Cordelia? <laughs> <laughs> She come and talk, bro. You want to go with her? Yeah. You're trying to kill me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>